All right, we're back. Hello, hello, everyone. Let's continue on with this series. What are we doing? All right, you're going to hold there. Okay, we're also going to get the Grand Temple here soon, which will be nice. We'll see what he decides to do, because now he's at minus gold, so that's good for us. Minus nine gold now. Okay. Uh, Memphis has grown uh, to, uh, to a large population at Lexi University, I know. Yeah. Um, keep trading with Prague. So next turn we're going to get our cannons. Or another cannon. So that'll be helpful. And then we've got a good amount of gold saved up, so in two turns we'll have rifling. Which means we'll be able to upgrade all these units and not necessarily storm through his lands, but I definitely think it's going to help. We're also getting another university here, so that's going to be nice. Um, yeah, I'm going to go against Siam on that. We're going to do that, and you're going to stay here. Because, you know, you get that and everything else, so... We got banks coming in now, so that'll also help us out. I want more units to put down this line so we can really kind of push him, but I don't think we're going to be able to. At least not to the level I want to, because I also want to get a cannon right here to smack him there. Okay, so we're going to have rifling now, which is good. So now we're in the industrial era, and now we can start... Upgrading these guys each few turns. So what do we need? 160 in gold. Okay. Uh, you're going to continue trading there. You're going to go ahead and trade with Chichen Itzu. And... Oh, I got another spy. Um, yeah, let's just see what the they're up to. Not all that worried, to be honest. How are we doing now on military? Still, it'll pro well, it updates next turn, that's right. So, we should be alright once the next turn comes up. Um, let's see what happens here. Because now I should be keeping up. Oh, they, yeah, they're eclipsing me pretty bad now. Okay, good to know. Oh, well, I got a great person, which is nice. Do we have anything we can build? Not really. We still need two more universities, so... Um, creating a production line here would be good. On something that already gives us a ton of production. Let's go over here. Um, I mean, I'm going to choose myself, of course. So you're going to hold. You're going to hold. So one more turn, we're going to have another bank going up. We'll have two more turns, and we've got the Grand Temple. I'm good, buddy. And then we'll have Industrial Era stuff, which means we might be able to build Big Ben. Uh, do we have Commerce Unlocked? We don't, so that's also something that's a problem. This would be good, um, once we can get that going. Yep. So now that's a plus seven, which will be really good for Thebes to work on. All right. Oh yeah, let me look at my advisors. So still, interesting. Okay, what did he just be? Oh, lo the Louvre. I was like, did he just build the pyramids <laughs> this late into the game? Oh man, that's funny. Uh, let's upgrade you. Um. I'm not worried about the arsenal. We don't need the setup yet. So let's start adding a production queue to riflemen. And that should be good. Once we're done with that, we'll have a full line here to kind of push them. 
I really need the Siamese to go to war with them, though. If those two go to war with each other, that will be, like, a good game for us. And I definitely could pay off the Siamese. I think I just need the money for it. Let me see something. How much to get you to declare war on the Aztecs? What do you want for this? Let's say 50 gold. My Mitan. 50 gold per turn, and they still won't. Interesting. Okay. Hmm, interesting. Okay. They're not ready yet. I mean, like I said, if the Aztecs decide they want to try this... Also, we're starting to put out a lot more pressure religiously, so that'll help. Because we're going to start seeing our gold hopefully climb a bit more. This will boost our happiness up here. Okay. Good. Go over there, and I need you to hold. Alright. Yeah, these guys are all getting major attrition now for religious stuff. Because my pressure is just so much. Attention, you have a large number of units. We mean no harm. Yeah, no. This is because you have a lot of units on my border. You, I'm not giving you the chance to declare war on me. Yeah, get that great work, please. That will be nice to have for the extra culture boost. Because uh, that gives us some extra, that gives us two extra turns, uh, or two, plus two to our, um, culture. So for culture victory, it looks like no one's winning yet. How much gold do you have? You're gonna pay seven, mate. Oh, you've got the money. So yeah, they're content currently. We definitely need to see what we can do. All right, we need more units, yeah. Okay. Oh, perfect, now I can go up to here and start converting these guys up here. Cause they're already getting so attrition through coming through my lands that they're not gonna be able to convert much longer. So if we start pushing our religion up here, well, our pressure's already amazing, so it won't be much of a problem for us, to be honest. I have no interest in declaring war on Pakal. Nope. I have interest in you right now. That's what I have an interest in. Yeah, places are starving. Well, they shouldn't be. And you're on default focus, so... You've got food all around you. Okay, we're gonna get coal Ooh, next turn, so that'll be nice. Alright, and we're going to start producing a lot of units coming out of Thebes to kind of open up this border a bit more. Nice. Can't upgrade you yet, so let's get you down there. Um, no, just get that. And now that you're up here, can you move up one? There you go. Convert them, please. There we go. Um... 441 gold, so let's upgrade you and upgrade you. Just in case. And we still got more banks coming in. No. Not happening, buddy. Sorry about that. We're going to switch them probably off production focus here soon, because we really don't need the production focus, in my opinion. Um, but... How are we doing on here? So there's, yeah, we're finally starting to catch up. I mean, it is really just raw unit power that he has right there. All right, well, there's a lot of pressure now going on him, so that's good. Okay, go ahead and hold. Next turn, we should be able to upgrade this guy. 
We have legit just been keeping him in the city just in case. But I think it's getting to that point where they're going to start to pull away too much if we don't do something soon. And we're gathering intelligence, but these are low-level spies, so I'm not going to gain much. Uh, yep. Get this guy down here. It'd be nicer to have him here, but these mountains make it basically impossible for us to do anything. Also, do we have any coal in our lands? Do we really have no coal? <laughs> we can see coal now, right? Like... Oh, god damn it. We have no coal at all. Mmm. That sucks. That sucks a lot. Those two went to war again. You're gonna do that. So our main goal is we just don't want our lines to be empty over here, because otherwise they'll come in and take Heliopolis so easily. Um, kind of the reason why I'm producing so many riflemen right now. That and the fact that we can, so we might as well. So it's definitely we're in a cold, what I'm calling a cold war period, in my opinion.